it's a complete our curriculum, so we should study hard. Let's start with your 16 lesson one. Water sack. Water sack. Please open your book, page 36. Open your book. Okay. What is the root of the word water? All of us know the word water. We drink the water. We water the plants. So it's a verb and a noun. It's a verb and noun. Verb and noun. What is the meaning of the word sack? What is the meaning of the word sack? The earth. The earth. Okay, this is the earth. Water moves around the earth by nature. Water moves, moves, okay, around the earth by nature. It's called water cycle. It's called water cycle. It means double in me. Okay. And this verb, recycle. What is the name of the word recycle? Like return, turn and return, die and redire. So you are in, okay? Evaporation. Okay, what is evaporation? When your mom heats water, it's uh, it's it, uh, when your mom heats water, it turns into it turns into water vapor, or it changes it changes into water vapor. Again, when your mom heats water, it turns into water vapor. Before you may. Okay. Okay. Again, what is evaporation? When your mom needs water, it turns into water vapor. Of course, evaporation is a noun. Evaporate is a verb. Okay. There is another process. Condensation. Condensation. In the morning, we see, we see the drops of water on the car, on the window. This is, this is called condensation. This is called condensation. In the name of drops, yes, drops turn into change. Liquid water is liquid. Gas water vapor. Rain snow. Okay. Let's read. Let's read page thirty-six, lesson one. Open your book. Let's read. Let's read. Okay. The title is The Water Cycle. Water moves around the earth all the time. It's recycled by nature. This is called the water cycle. So what happens? Okay. A. How are clouds form? How are clouds form? In the sky, these small drops of water are blown together by the wind. When billions of small drops Join together the four clouds. The four clouds. B. How is the snow made? Water drops don't always become rain. When it's very cold, water drops turn into ice and they fall to the ground. This is snow. What is evaporation? When the sun shines, it causes the water in rivers, lakes, and the sea to evaporate. This means that Water is turned from a liquid into a gas. This gas is called water vapor. How is made rain? How is rain made? If the drops are very big and heavy, they fall through the clouds to the ground. This is rain. <clears throat> the last one is what is condensation caused by? As the water vapor moves up into the air, it becomes cooler. The water vapor changes into very small drops of water. This is called condensation. You can sometimes see condensation on the inside of a wind. Okay. Let's have the structure. <clears throat> I drink tea every day. This sentence is an after sentence. Oil is the subject. Yes, drain, verb, tea object, and whatever. So, this is active sentence. Gumla, but then manu, however, subject is known. Subject is known. Which language is spoken in your country? When I ask you which language is spoken in your country, of course, Arabic. Arabic is spoken in Egypt. Arabic is spoken in Egypt. Look at this sentence, Arabic, 
Okay? Subject. Is this book and verb? And so on. Arabic. Can Arabic speak? No. Of course no. So when the subject can to do the action, can to do the verb, this is passive. Again, another sentence. Football is played all over the world. Football, yes. When we say Muhammad Salah plays football, Messi plays football, okay? When we say someone, we put the verb play. But when we, when we say something, something, can't do the action, is played. Look at, is played. This is passive. Again, another example, clouds are formed. Clouds. Can clouds form? No. They are formed. This is the passive. Okay? Look at the form. Is, or, are, plus. Look at the verb. Plus, past participle. Plus, past participle. Regular or regular or irregular. Okay, look at the question. How are clouds forming? Question where? Or, or is? Subject and post participle. Okay? This is the passive. Mabni, lil mabu. When the subject can't do the action. Okay? The present simple passive. Present All of us know the present simple. We put is or are. We look at the verb. The verb is in the present simple. Drank. Okay? We look at the verb. So we put is or are. Okay? According to the subject. Al hasab al fi'al. Which we begin. Of course, you get it. Mm, let's answer. Okay, there is another example. This is no for me. This is no for me. The answer is gone. Yes, no question. Okay. Let's answer to understand. Let's answer. Number one water, space, recycled by nature. Water mm, has, has, is. Or are, of course, we put is. Why? Because it's a passive. It's a present simple passive. Water, science. When we speak, when we speak about science, we put, of course, we put the present simple. We use the present simple. When we speak about science, of course, we use the present simple. And this sentence is in passive. Okay? Number two, how are cakes? Made, makes, making, or make, of course, made. Why? Because, a, because it's passive. Number three, how many languages speak in Africa? Speaking, speak, spoke, are spoken. Mm. How many languages are spoken? How many? Okay, question word, languages. Now, plural noun and are spoken. Of course. <clears throat> the last part, correct. Where are rice grown? Hmm. Of course, are is false. We put rice. Rice. Countable or uncountable? Of course, uncountable. So we put is. When the noun is. When the noun is uncountable, we put is. Where is rice grown? Okay. Number two, we should cycle all the people. What's wrong? We should cycle all the people. Oh, recycle. Recycle. Okay. <clears throat> Where are the last one? Where are white tigers found? Hmm. Of course, we put found. Please. The homework answers the booklet, page 54.